Uh, for this painting, we're going to paint an eyeball. And uh, I'll use some different colors as we go along, but I don't know quite exactly what I'm going to use, but we'll use something in green. Red. We'll use something. We haven't used green yet. We'll use green. Alright, so I'm going to paint an eyeball. It's going to be in different types of greens, and there's going to be some white, uh, some black. You'll need just the colors will come. Alright, here we go. Oh, nice. Here's the other one. Right. Here's the board. So dark. Just circle around it. Make some weird colors. Some newspaper again. For an eye, I like to pinch it at the middle. I'm just going to ask that. Alright, so it's directly at the middle. And just a light touch. A light, light, light touch. A light touch. Right. So we have our eye. I'm going to put a stencil on it. A planet stencil. Actually, well, first we're going to make people but we're gonna cover it up and we're gonna make the shape of our eye we we'll keep this part white so we're gonna spread white around it green and black we'll have some stars again uh, this is a tint color I'm just going to gently spray it on the top then we're going to lift this up, we're going to see how it looks. Alright, so that's how it looks right now. I'm going to fix it with the black a little. There's a shadow underneath the eyeball. Over it. So that's how it looks. Right now. I'm going to add a little bit of a reflection. Right here. Okay. A little bit of a reflection there. And let's see. Um, what else do I want to add? Actually, let's add this. Some green. Light green. And then some black. Then the reflection of an eye. Right. 
And in between here, in between the space is going to be all bamboo. We haven't used gold. We can add a gold tinge to this. Not really a tinge. Alright. I'm gonna make the water again. See sign. That's how it's looking right now. I'm gonna make some land on the bottom. We'll make this a little bit different than everything else. So we're gonna add this type of blue. And we'll add some pink. All right, there we go. Grab the newspaper again and just touch. Sorry if it's a little messy. Touch. Touch. This is just to set it apart. Touch of white over it. Right. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to add a big tree. A humongous tree. First, we're going to add some grass. Just up and down for your grass. And if you need to add some like depth to it, put on a palette color and then go again. So that's a chunk. And we'll have a huge tree. Different branches. the color knife off right. and with my fan brush it's easier for me to use this I like to use my fan brush what I do is I just grab it and just just dab it on let the colors mix Some different colors. You can add a tint, and we'll add this color, and we'll add a blue. 
You don't have to clean your brush off. Just dab when you think you should add it. Try not to be uniform about it. Just make it wherever. Mix the colors if you want. Extend the tree if you want. comment this time. Alright, and then we'll add, if I can, we will add a little person here, just right in here. Well, I guess I'll show you guys. Now. This is how it looks right now. Alright, so we're going to add a person. I like to start in a diamond shape. And once you make the diamond, the bottom of the diamond, you should form the legs. So form the legs going down. And his little arm. So the arm. And his long spear. Give him like a long spear. And then his head. Then you can detail him if you want. There we go. This one's done. Right. So my crystal clear, and then we'll sign it. Nikita. 2015. There we go.